Hey YouTube, I got a question. I got two awesome melee weapons here in PAL World. We have Lily's Spear, which is considered rare, or the sword, which is considered common, but has a higher attack stat. I had to put this to the test, so you wouldn't have to. So I went to one of my favorite mining spots, Mount Obsidian, to put these two to the test, head to head, to figure out which one is truly the best mining weapon. I don't know about you, but if I had to put bets, I'd be betting on Lily's Spear with that rarity. Comment below which one you think is going to be the ultimate winner. Now out of this cluster of seven rocks for ore, I decided that three from each side would go to each weapon. Three for Lily's Spear, three for the sword. When I was done, I had 120 ore exactly from both weapons. But that's where the similarities seem to end. To harvest three complete rocks of ore with the spear, averaging 203 damage all the way up to 247 damage per thrust. It took 62 thrusts and did a total of 62 damage to the durability of the weapon, bringing us to 438 out of 500 durability. Despite the spear having a rare status, the common sword comes through with the win. Only needing 54 swings, averaging damage from 240 all the way up to 200. 88 damage per swing we left our sword at a 446 out of 500 durability or just 54 damage versus the 62 it does appear that each swing thrust or however you want to say use of each melee does one damage to the durability but the sword was definitely faster doing more damage per hit and that seems to have a very clear conclusion to me with the sword coming out on top as much as i love the spear and don't get me wrong it's definitely worth crafting and using once you have the sword available I would upgrade to that. I've been your host, Yakman. Thank you for watching.